Hi, in today's video, we're excited to demonstrate the Navix Apple CarPlay Android Auto smartphone mirroring and backup camera interface for the 2009 through 2017 Audi A5 with the Audi Concert AMI radio system. If your car has the MMI system, we have a solution for you as well. So please make sure to go to Navix.com, put in your year, make and model, and look up a solution for your vehicle. We'll demonstrate first Android Auto, then we'll switch to CarPlay, we'll show you mirroring, and then we'll show you the backup camera. So let's switch over to Android Auto by holding the iNav button on the steering wheel. And we've already connected our Android phone using a wire, a regular charging cable. So let's start with, I guess, Vase. We'll show you Vase first. All right, let's change the view. And as you see, we're using all factory buttons, no external switches, no external microphones. All right, let's go to Google Maps. We'll just quickly show you a few of the apps and then we'll switch to CarPlay just because there's a lot of functions to show. So we'll go through this quickly. Let's do the same thing, change the view. All right, let's go to uh, TuneIn Radio to show you music app. All right, local radio station. There we go. So now we'll now we'll switch phones. We're gonna switch to CarPlay. So we're doing it wired, but it can be done wirelessly and wired for the CarPlay. All right, let's go to uh, Google Maps. All right, let's change the view here as well. Let's zoom in here. All right, let's go to the audio file, play music file. That's CarPlay for you. Uh, now we'll show you the mirroring function. So the unit has an HDMI input and using the Apple AV adapter, we're gonna mirror the iPhone. So let's go to YouTube. We'll show you YouTube and then we'll show you the backup camera. Alright, let's try another YouTube video. Alright, now we'll show you the backup camera. So if you have the factory camera, will continue to work the same way. This car did not have a camera, so we added a camera to this vehicle. Um, it gives you also dynamic guidelines. If you move the steering wheel, the lines will move with the steering wheel. You can also add a front view camera using this interface. We did not do so on this vehicle. We do have the ability to add a front camera as well. 